In this channel, you've seen how to run Facebook ads and Instagram ads plenty. But very rarely will I encourage you to run a certain type of placement and that is Instagram story placements. So today I wanted to break them down and show you exactly how to run them the right way. Hey, it's Jaime. If we're just meeting, welcome to the channel that brings actionable content to grow your business through online marketing. So if that sounds beneficial, consider subscribing. All right, let's look at Instagram stories. We're here on business.instagram.com to see what they have to say. You see they have over 500 million users that use stories every single day. That's a lot of people. And as a reminder, those stories are at the top of your Instagram. As soon as you log into Instagram, you see people's stories. And as soon as you start scrolling, scrolling, scrolling sideways as opposed to uh, vertically, then you're going to see your Instagram story ads. So that is the placements. There's really not that much information that business.instagram.com gives us. It just says, hey, use it. And then they give a few examples and success stories from larger companies. So I wanted to go a little bit more, more detailed. There's basically two things that you can do. Either you put an image on stories as your advertisement, or you put the a video that is formatted as a story as an ad. So it's either an image or a video or a combination of the two, but we're not going to get into that specific, um, that, that type of, that type of ad. So when you're looking for that perfect image, when you're looking for an image that is formatted correctly for Instagram stories, I highly encourage that you go to Canva. Canva is free unless you want to go to the pro version. I have never paid Canva or have done the pro version. So just know that Canva, the free version, works perfectly. All you have to do is select a template that you want to start with. Let's just say that one. And it's going to give you some, I mean, it is perfect. All you have to do is swap all of these out if you wanted to include multiple. But if you want to just do one image, all you have to do is delete the others and then adjust. Adjust whatever you want it to look like. You import, you import images and then you can swap that out. You can add text. You can add anything that you want. So here blah 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 i'm not going to worry about that part because this is this is more for you to do so i would just download it and now i have my file in image form that is formatted correctly to the instagram story so that's one thing that's if you wanted to do an image now some of you may be wanting to do a video and that is perfectly fair because videos have a high engagement so what you um what you can do at that point is go to a company or go to a website like in video.io and get their free plan as well. So here is, these are templates of Instagram stories and these are videos. So you see right here, this would be a great review video. So let's just say pre-made templates. You can do article to video. You can do blank templates. Let's just go with the pre-made templates. This looks fantastic actually. So you would just click on that and then you see the per perfectly formatted video, some cheesy background, all that stuff. You can actually change that out, but you can use this template and start adjusting it. Start um, reformatting it if you want to start uh, putting your own reviews, whatever you want to say. This is something for you to design. Again, there are these. Are, this is a free website, so you can log in, create your account, and then you're on your way. I think um, there are some limitations to the free plan. Um, and you can't do this indefinitely, then you would have to go to the pro plan. But this is a great place to start. You can select the music, you can select the text that you want. You can select, well, images, stickers, effects, and all that fun stuff. But here you can adjust, uh, let's see, this is a review. Awesome, preview and export. Right here, it's gonna go through a little preview. I'm just gonna download it. So you see how super quick it is. Again, this is free to sign up. So I'll leave that link down below for you to do it. And then it's gonna process. And that is basically all you need to do. We've covered the image and we've covered the video. Now let's go on and create the actual ad. We, again, we know that stories present differently. We know that they present up and down. So whenever you create an ad, regardless of which one it is, I highly encourage you to create its own digital assets for the stories. So stories need to have their own formats because they're gonna present so much better. So I'll show you what that looks like right now. We're gonna create an ad. And then on this type of ad, I'm not gonna to put too much stock in 
how to set it up because I want you to see where to go to get the Instagram stories going. All right, so assuming that you're running an ad in the special ad category, let's just say you're running a housing ad. As a reminder, special ad category, credit, employment, and housing, those are the types of ads that you do have to select that it's a special ad, which it falls under the special ad category. All right, so we're gonna leave it under traffic. Not gonna worry about split testing or any of that right now. We're just gonna worry about going to the next screen. All right, we're not gonna worry about name, website, or anything like that. I just wanna show you the most important part. As a reminder, whenever you're list, uh, advertising, let's just say trying to get listings, make sure that you select people living in this location, not people interested in this location, especially if you're getting listings, as a reminder. If you're getting buyers and doing some relocation, then yes, it would be okay for you to leave that up there, but for the majority of the people, the this is the right play. And then you're gonna select the geography. So we're gonna scroll right down here to the important part. I'm bypassing all of this because I have a lot of other videos, a lot of other, other resources that you can draw upon to get um, all of the placements, I'm sorry, all of the targeting and everything else when it comes to lead generation, especially for real estate lead. And now you can drop the Facebook stories if you would like. Sometimes you're gonna get a little error message up here saying that you need to have both of them on. That's not the case, so just be aware of that. Even though it says it, it won't preclude you from launching the ad, but just be on just be on the lookout. Sometimes they do want you to keep both of them on, so just be just be aware of that. So you would just unselect the Facebook stories and only leave Instagram stories running. Then you would go to next, select your Instagram account that you're gonna link it up to. I don't have a I don't have an account linked up to this particular demo account, so I'm not gonna be able to select that today. And then when it says fix one error message that is asking for a landing page. So at this point, or a website. At this point, all you have to do is upload from whatever you just did, upload the image through here. Remember, we went to Canva to download. Right over here, this got us the download. And then we went to InVideo to get that. So all we have to do is just download it now. And it's gonna download onto our computer. So if you're gonna do the image, you would just upload right here and you're on your way. And then also, if you're gonna do the video, then you would add the video right there, upload it. Again, it just downloaded, so you would have that as your ad, and then finish up your primary text. So let's just say this, buy this house. Assuming you are advertising a house, and you would certainly have better ad copy than that. And then just put your website, or your landing page, wherever you're sending traffic to. Then you would hit publish, and you've created your Instagram story ad. Well, now that you know how to run Instagram story ads the right way, you'll wanna learn how to run Instagram ads on the newsfeed. So I'll leave a video right here that's gonna help you do just that. Also, if you found value today, please be sure to subscribe. It really does help me out. And of course, make it your best day yet.